Hey guys, so I got a lot of questions asking how to kind of register and align meshes in Romexis. So first thing you're seeing here, this is Romexis 6 kind of beta. It's it's pretty amazing. Um, basically all the patient's files are instantly available and, and located in basically a, kind of like this little preview window here. So when you click on a patient, you get all their files, 3D, CBCT, DICOMs, photographs, everything, and, and you just double click them to open the proper module. So here we're just clicking on this face scan, opening it up into the 3D module in Romexis, and it's coming in, um, changing the color. Let's, that's not even the right color. Let's make it Plan Mecca pink. There we go. All right, so now we need to register and align an intraoral scan to this mesh, um, and, and Plan Mecca actually has the best software for this. So we're just gonna go ahead and, um, bring in here hold on you just click the right there under the fitting you're going to go ahead and click and open the fitting module and it's kind of designed for bringing in two face scans and and comparing them but you pick any any two models stl files um and then these these two models are not aligned and you're just going to paint kind of a common area on one model and then paint a common area on the other model in this case, the intraoral scan, and then hit fit. And it's gonna go through a, a really sophisticated iterative best fit alignment, and you're gonna get a color-coded match, and that's it. It's so easy, it's actually extremely powerful. I like it better than ExoCAD alignment. And what you're gonna do from here is you're just gonna go, because it's open, right? You're just gonna go up to export, and save each one of these as a STL file. And then you could open up in any software like even plan cat easy and start waxing the case up with the patient's file smile um, right there like we're going to show at the end of this video um, you could do anything you could register those meshes and you could even then save them as one stl file and then register more meshes to that it's just a really cool feature that i don't think anybody really knows about and it's uh, one that i use all the time to align meshes because if you look at like free softwares out there the ICP algorithms are pretty weak and they're just not very intuitive to use I'm thinking of mesh mixer mesh lab um, all those types of programs blender doesn't even have an ICP so just something something for you guys to use if you have this um, I think it's it's underutilized for sure so once again exporting each one of those individual files now let's check and see if it if they open up in another software uh, registered and aligned together. So we're just gonna go ahead and open up the face scan first from the saved STL export right out of Romexis. And we're gonna see real quick when we bring that in that it's a, just a standard STL mesh. Um, now you can do plies as well. You could do OBJs with Romexis being completely open. You could do anything with Romexis, obviously. Now we're gonna bring in the exported intraoral scan, we're gonna see if they come out aligned perfectly, just like they, see? So just like they were from Romexis. Very nice. Love, love, love this. Underutilized. People just don't really understand the power of Romexis. <laughs>